Good evening, viewers, and welcome to this edition of NTV Sports Page. It's Friday, the 3rd of July, and I'm Curtis Morton. In our headlines, new sports minister meets with staff, and in our feature for this evening, we feature some regional under-19 cricket from the year 2017. We'll take this break, and I'll be right back. Welcome to Nevis. It's easy to believe that all Caribbean islands are the same until you visit Nevis. Nevis is the Caribbean of a bygone era. You will enjoy a most intimate vacation on Nevis. You're only a stranger here once. We offer exclusive and barefoot luxury stays. With only 400 hotel rooms, our island may be exclusive. But the warm, genuine and friendly welcome is just everywhere. We look forward to meeting you. Visit nevisisland.com. Well, I'm back and we start with this item in general sports. St. Kitts Nevis' new Minister of Sports, the Honorable John L. Powell, met with the staff of the Ministry and the Department of Sports on Wednesday, July 1st, and led discussions on ways to enhance the programs and overall effectiveness of the government entities. There's a lot in store for the Department of Sports and Sports in general in St. Kitts and Nevis, he told the staff during the meeting at the Players' Pavilion at the Warner Park Cricket Stadium. Many of the changes will be inspired by the draft national sports policy and the accompanying national sports strategy, which are currently under consideration by the Cabinet of Ministers. The policy charts a way forward for sports development within the Federation. It outlines the responsibility of government, national sporting organizations and other stakeholders in this endeavor. The national sports policy is going to be very important in guiding us through the process in terms of developing what we have built what we are building on, what we have, adding disciplines and improving on our capacity, Minister Powell stated. It does mean that there will be some restructuring in the way in which we do things, so as not to just improve sports and sports administration in St. Kitts and Nevis, but also to improve your conditions, your ability to do the work that you have to do in whatever capacity, whatever role you play, the Minister added. An area of concern identified by Minister Powell is the maintenance of sporting facilities around the island. He explained that he would lobby the Cabinet to consider an additional arrangement that will assist with the upkeep of these facilities. Maintenance work is carried out by the Public Works Department. After making opening remarks, the Minister opened the floor for questions, concerns and suggestions to be exchanged. He promised that such interactions would be a regular feature among the ministries and departments under his purview. We'll take this break and I'll be back with our feature for this evening. Hi, my name is Joanne Fleming and I'm a lawyer here at Myrna R. Walwyn & Associates. Sometimes trying to exercise and eat healthy can be challenging, especially when you work a 9 to 5 job. However, starting my fit journey has been one of the best decisions I've made. I now have increased levels of energy that last me throughout the day, and exercise is a great way to reduce stress and anxiety. So, if you've started your fit journey, stick with it. And if you haven't, come join us. And remember, fit is beautiful. Well, I'm back, and tonight cricket is in the spotlight. The year was 2017, and Jamie Cornelius opened the innings for the Leeward Islands Under-19 team versus the Windwards in the regional Under-19 tournament. Let's take in some moments.
Well, that's our package for this evening and indeed for the week. I am Curtis Morton reminding you that you can watch sports if you're not fit. But to play sports requires fitness, diligence, and sacrifice. Have a good night and a great weekend.